brown and colorful ceremony, the official flag off of the APC governorship campaign for Renewed Hope 2023 took place today at the Dan Iam Stadium of Wari, the Amos State capital. The event was a significant milestone for the political landscape of the state. Drawing the massive crowds of supporters and political enthusiasts across the 27 local government areas of Imo. Also, also, Barrister Charles Chokwode, Baba Tunde, as well. We can work here with former chairman of PDP Imo State. Okay, so what is happening here today, sir? Well, I've come to identify with our governor, our performing governor. Yes, sir. Um, are you aligning yourself with what is happening here? Of course. If, if I don't, you will see me here. Okay. I'm here because I am satisfied with all the government have done so far. In the last three and a half years, he has been in office. How do you assess him as it was before and now? Everybody can see the, 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 the change. The change is obvious. Are you talking about the road infrastructures? Are you talking about the, the education sector, the health sector? Every other aspect of the economy is just entirely a brand new thing. Um, talking about Imo Chatter of Equity, and you are from Oki West Zone, as you mentioned. Yes. What do you say about Imo Chatter of Equity? Well, I'm a lawyer to start with, and uh, naturally as a lawyer, I believe in equity. Okay. Because the law of equity says that he who goes to equity must go with clean hands. But the, the situation, if we find ourselves in Imo politics today, has made it possible, has made it easier for us okay. by accepting to support the governor for a second term, after which we cannot talk about the rotation. For the fact that the governor has performed so well in his first term, it is very important that we recognize the fact that we all should give him support for the second term. But after that, we cannot talk about where it will rotate to. Okay, sir. And uh, if you want to, uh, by, by, my own, by, by, by my own consideration, thinking about where it will rotate to should depend on how the kind of support the, the, the zone gives to the governor in this election. Because if you are saying you believe in this equity, which states that governor should complete four years of his eight years then all, then he must demonstrate it in this election. Okay. He must demonstrate it in this election. Because if after this election you are saying it is your turn and he did not vote for Governor Hobos anymore, which means he did not support this equity, then you don't expect that equity to come to you. But because he who wants equity must do equity. So if you want equity, whereby you are claiming that it will be your turn after the Hobos and must turn, he must also support the Hobos and in this election. So between our Kibwe zone and Onu zone and our zone, any zone that does more, that does more for Senator Hobos and Emma should be tied to the next election. What is your word to your brothers who are contesting from our Kibwe zone in another party? Well, you know, I saw all of them before I came to identify with Senator Hobos and Emma. Okay, sir. I know that Senator Hobos and Emma for now is the best. Okay. All I'm begging my brothers from Okibwe zone is that if they are saying it is their turn after Senator Hope, they should give hope at least 95% of, of the total votes for the zone. They should vote for hope at least 95% from Okiwa zone so that hope will be happy to support them. They cannot be saying it is your turn after hope and you don't support hope. Which means you don't even believe in that equity you are talking about. So my advice to my brothers from Okiwa zone is to, to at vote at vote over the zone in the next coming election. Let them vote more than over the zone for hope and I know that the hope is a man of conscience. He will always consider the best for Imo after his own tenor.